Savith is one of the best professional Hearthstone players of all time, and I thought it would be fun to challenge him to a best of five money match in Classic. Okay, uh, so he is playing, playing Miracle, Zoo Warlock, and Combo. Let's go. If he's gonna start with Zoo, I want to start with, I think Handlock is just the best deck I can start with every single time, right? So we'll start with Handlock. Oh, this is gonna be easy. <laughs> Uh, so he's starting with Zoo. Okay. That's actually really good for me. May I catch your just like the old days. Hellfire should be good. I also really like Ancient Watcher. The question is, do I want to keep Soulfire? We definitely don't keep Soulfire. Pretty good. Pretty good. Could look for Molten. Molten's also really good. I think I'll keep these two. I'm not sure about the Ancient Watcher, but it should be okay. Molten's good. Ranga is not it, dude. We kept the Voidwalker. Good. Our is fine. We're chilling. Mark. Chill. No Leper Norman 1 because there could be a Mortal Coil. Maybe I want to see that. Let me think this through. If I tap this turn, I feel icky. Tap, and then I can probably go Molten Giant into Argus. That's probably my play. Yeah, we'll tap. As long as he doesn't have a buff for like the Void Walk here. No. Okay, Coin Hellfire. Let's keep that. Let's buff that to four. Yeah, I, I have to go Coin Hellfire. Pick my only out. Sheesh. Tapping is really good for me. It's actually insane. Now he's, he's got to think about Molten. Can I give that Molten Giants right now? I respect it. I like the idea of soul firing a 3-2 here. I'm almost going to have to go Argus guaranteed next turn. I mean, he can still play a Molten Giant, but he can't taunt it up. That's the big deal. He has Doom Guard, Soul Fire. It's a lot of damage from hands. It's a little bit of a risky call, but I think that's correct. Okay. Second Molten off the top secures my victory. Shadow Flame. Shadow Flame is kind of insane for the following turn. Oh God, this is so spooky, man. Face. I lose to Doom Guard every single time. So I'm pretty confident like I have to do this. I actually can't get away with doing anything else here. Doom Guard just wins though. This is Soulfire. Ooh, two, 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 two. Oh, he outholed me, dude. I thought this was a good matchup. Wow. If there was a second mold, then I might have still lost. Had a really good start that game. It was the start where I was like, okay, okay, like triple one drops, uh, played around the coil if it was there. It just, I, I felt like after a triple one drops, even though there was a hellfire, I just, I, I kind of like had a good creep on the board. I feel, that, feel like I had the right ideas getting the shattered on buff to make the minion survive the hellfire. The ancient watcher didn't actually do anything for me. So maybe I should have thrown it back for a second molten giant. That was, that was ridiculous if i let the um molten get taunted that turn like sure i had an owl in my hand but then it can get taunted again the turn after because I, I can't actually kill so fast so god that's so unfortunate dude i had a, I had a really solid draw and like uh you know he just got lucky okay he just got lucky that's what it is he had a good hand he played his mana every single turn feels bad okay so druid obviously we just want to dodge the coin or sorry we want to dodge wild growth getting the coins actually pretty decent because they have one less chance to actually get it oh baby oh baby do i ever keep argus or do I look for giants. I think I look for giants. Wild Crow don't do. I don't think it's any of those. If they fall, oh, he kept a card. I remember in the old days, it was used to be like, if you Wild Crow don't do, you win like 60. 5% of the time or something. It's also not a matchup where I would get like giga pressured right now. It's illegal. <sighs> you suck. All right, we have a decent hand at least. I wonder if I ever coin Twilight Drake. I don't think so. Oh, interesting. The Power of the Wild is fine. I'll do both of them. There's some merit in doing just one, but I like doing both here. If I go coin Twilight and he has the keeper, do I just lose? A little more pressure. Arguably, but it's probably correct. Better trades. And tap nothing here is probably bad. This is a big boy. He keepers me, it sucks, but at least the Twilight Drake lives. It's not the most terrifying thing. Okay, we can kill Azure, which is pretty great. Definitely gonna go face here. It's always this, right? My Mountain Giant's never getting played, unfortunately, but that's just the nature of the game if he has wild growth. Might have been better for our run to just don't the uh, watcher. If I could just like not get overran, we should be in an okay position here. Okay, we probably wanna keep that for combo. I might have a full clear if I played it now. It's so bad if you go down zero and three. I don't think I like that. This 
Yeah, a little bit of bummer. I don't have any Empowered Wilds anymore, now that I have the teacher. Um, we have Shadowflame for next turn, so it's definitely not the worst thing in the world. I kind of like the Argus here. It's more stats. Yeah, we're already seeing two Power Overwhelming, so it's not like them getting a bunch of extra 1-1s one is really going to be that bad. I'm still looking pretty good. Got the Angel of War for next turn. Haven't seen any Giant. Giants are terrifying. I could trade this. I could just silence it down and tap. Maybe that's more correct. I don't remember how favorite the matchup is. It's not necessarily a good thing, though. I think it's going to be Argus. Kill your opponent from, uh, from life, though so high is then the uh the ancient watcher at least contest the the violet teacher right really glad like really glad i didn't silence last turn sylvanas okay so this is kind of bad to siphon so but this is a really good silence target though i don't know if he plays them or if he only plays one maybe we go silence into argus is that ever good we go silence i could use just power overwhelming to kill this right now i just need more setup and i need the time to like and and uh draw to get the hit the roar you can watch here. Okay. I think about positioning here. Be soul fire. No. Oh. Oh, it's a. Uh, okay. Or do I just power overwhelming and kill? I guess in theory that's a scary. I don't really care about the Violet Teacher at all. It's like I could just shadow flame. Even if I shadow flame the Asian Watcher, it's fine. They would have made a one one, but I I think we just chill here. What if I go power overwhelming into Sylvanas or Mountain Giant actually, and then I can taunt the Mountain Giant? And I'll see the boy in the Wild Crow. I might need the card to throw when I have ten crystals. Okay, that's Giant now finally. Almost did that wrong. <laughs> Almost didn't play a Mountain Giant there. I guess worst case scenario, I could have just played Sylvanas, but I think the eight is actually just generally better. Again, pretty weak. Well, if he has a Hellfire, it also damages his own vultures. It wouldn't be all bad. So I could Shadow Flame the 5-6 the Taunt, play an Argus and go face. Alternatively, I can go Sil Sun Fury Protector, Faceless Manipulator, the Mountain Giant. Kind of like that more. And Argus with this, right? Again, it might have been... Well, okay, no. Okay, that's pretty strong. Okay, that is pretty strong. I think we're in a pretty good spot. I think we won. He had wild growth on curve too. Ooh, I don't have the roar. I think it's on, I think I like I can never die here. I don't have the roar. A lot of the cards in his hand have to be like combo pieces, right? He used both power of the wilds pretty early on. I mean, I have to clear these. They're gonna kill me. <laughs> yeah, that's completely fine. Are you sure I don't like a overthrow here? Or like a Mesa dude. Over spawn, dude. That was a force of nature down. There's the giants. I'm pretty sure I have to go into uh we face Tyraxus. Shadow Flame here. Now I'm like further away from the combo. The problem with Argusing again is like I lose my last Get a spell power swipe. It would have been pretty sweet there. Spell power swipe would have been very good. Oh my god, this is so scary. Hmm, let's give you a health I think it's better. Okay. Let's go for a better molten giant, I guess. We can set up the spell of our swipe for next then. Okay, that's fine. Wrath is okay. Oh, he drew. Oh, it's a lethal setup potentially. Double swipes in face. Am I dead? He goes Force of Nature, double Savage Roar. I'd be dead to it anyways if I Shadow Flame here, right? Uh, if I Shadow Flame an Argus, Sylvanas into Argus probably seems okay. Oh, this is so spooky, man. I don't know if this is actually good. I could be misplaying this entirely. It's very scary. Looking pretty good. Looking good. Ooh. I haven't seen an innervate, but I just saw Force of Nature. He would go Force of Nature, Savage Roar. It's 14. I silence that. Bell bar swipe it. No, let's try to set it up for next turn, I think. This is a swipe. Swipe face, maybe? Or he's going for taunts. Okay, getting to the molten zone now. I'm pretty sure I'm tapping here. Like, I have to be able to set up lethal, right? I died to force of nature double savage worm. That's that's the out for him, right? So it's like this, this. I think I just shadow flame this. I don't think it's ever gonna be good enough anymore. Mm. I could just be very well dead here, but th this is at least gives me lethal. I hate playing against Druid so much. It's so sketchy, dude. Okay, okay. Maybe he doesn't have it. I feel like I would be dead if he had it already. Okay, that's really good actually. I die too often otherwise. It's like you still die to lead, right? Soulfire. 
Oh yeah, I could actually be dead. I could combo fast enough. If I tap and go to nine, I can put myself back up to 15. Yeah, I could easily be dead. I did I did feel like I have to use the first force it when I did it. Uh-oh. Oh, I'm losing right now. Oh God. If I got Lee right there, obviously it was lethal. One out of 10 when I don't ever die here. Unless he has exactly like very specific cards. No, it's too late. Wait, is he in there? Wait, still two mana. It is, but I didn't. Okay, we don't have any. Suffer as the wild lands suffer. No way, I'm dead. I must safeguard <laughs> my heart, dude, my heart. Got me. Damn it, Rodron. I don't know. It just didn't come together. I didn't get the combo fast enough. They used the one piece. I'm also playing the version without Big Game Hunter. Big Game Hunter used to be really popular. I'm glad I won. I can't believe I won. My heart was racing there. Could have been a quick 3-0 for Savits, but I'm glad I got on the board. We have actually a pretty good lineup. It's a mirror match, basically. And then we have Control Warrior. There might, there might have been like, if I went back on it and looked at like one turn by turn, there might have been something that I uh, could have maybe done different. But yeah, well played by Rodan. But uh, the Miracle Rogue matchup, maybe I should have queued up Warrior actually. Cause if I queue up Warrior and he queues up Miracle Rogue, it's just better for me. Cause now if he wins with Miracle Rogue, I lose. Oh God. Yeah, I should have queued up Warrior. Warrior is better. Oh, and I'm going first. Oh my God, it's a tragedy. All right, so the way you beat this, this deck is just by playing big minions. I should probably look for ramp, but there's also a case where I just don't draw anything good. That's pretty good. All right, three drops are fine. Unfortunately, I did not get the wild gift, but it is what it is. Easy top deck. <gasps> Easy. Hmm. Wow. All right, Yeti's good. Really? You would do that to me? Yeti's going to do some work if he doesn't have a sap here. <laughs> it's so bars. rude. I come as a guest on your show and, and you play your turn to chill with Yeti on me like just like it's nothing. The coin Yeti. All right, well, I do need the dagger. All right, we play a 3-3. Three, three. That's another thing on board. We have the Wrath and a Hero Power next turn, or we can just go into another Earthring Farseer. My hand is very good. I kind of want to keep the Poison for after Auctioneer. But that might be a horrible mistake. Ooh, that Enervate off the top. I believe, man. You could call it lucky. You could call it lucky, but is it a skill gap? It's going to be so powerful when I do it. Wild Growth into uh, Wrath. Interesting. I like it. It's better than Farseer, right? Oh, boy. Strong hand though. All right, this is huge, man. This is huge. If I can win as Druid against Miracle Rogue, it's basically a lockup because the warrior is like unbeatable against it. This is really bad for him. Karen. Now the problem with Karen is if I get sapped, I lose too much tempo, right? I'm hoping he's a, here's a, like a weaker turn though. No, I think I'm just going with Adric. I don't think I ever played Karen. Nope. <laughs> That's not a weaker turn. Need a preparation. Maybe I should have gone Karen. It's hard. I don't think it's worth it though. So if you guys gadgets and coin conceal, okay. This draws more than the Drake would. Ah! Now I get the back step. Well, that's kind of weak. Maybe I just play Karen then. I guess Karen's a dude. Okay, well, that's not too bad. Okay, we definitely gotta go for it. How gross is this turn gonna be? Oh, there we go. Oh, that was a huge draw. I really needed that one. Oh god. Not the not the shadow step. We need this on the board. It's a huge threat. Okay, well at least Yeti makes me feel a little bit better about the play I'm about to make, because this one feels honestly atrocious. I absolutely need to kill this, so I have to do this. Kinda sucks, but it is what it is. So three cards and a one of them is a cairn. He doesn't know what I have, right? He, he might actually have to play around Force of Nature Savatory. I've seen two eviscerates, which is really, really good. Unfortunately, no, uh, no, no conceal. That's been like the main issue this game. Oh, I think I know what to do. Oh my God, it's too early. No, it's too early for this. I'm gonna mess up. Go uh, this into this, and we're in a really good spot. Like he, he kind of. All right. Oh, no, 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 no. Oh. I'll follow through with that. Thinking eight seems bad. I was even thinking about like Leroy, but that's bad. Me, not leave me with anything on the board. I must safeguard ah, okay. But I know that there's only one. There's a Cairn in the hand, so. A keeper of the Grove top deck was illegal, dude. The shadow step. He doesn't have the second Gadsden. I haven't seen a conceal yet. I don't think I die. Seems unlikely. I mean, they could be like top deck second combo piece, but. Oh God, the claw. Yeah, I'm pretty. 
confident I have to do this. Okay, that's not it. Easy swipe. Okay. Nine in the hand. He has 12, which means Leroy's lethal. Kind of have to taunt. He has to get through it at least, which means I'm probably not dead. If I swipe the Azure Drake and I push face, that's five damage. He needs exactly Cold Blood and Leroy for me to lose this game. If I taunt, there's no out, so I guess I just always go for it. That's the can, right? No. Oh, is he going face? Oh, he's gonna have to pay for that one. So if he can't kill me, I win. All right. Well, I got there. The logic there, if I, if I taunt, um, I don't win the game next turn anyways, right? Lee ho ho! Okay. Wow. That's an interesting one. Well played. Based on the starting hand, when I was looking at my hand, I was like, oh, we got this. But then, like, then Rara also had, like, pretty explosive starts with the inner Medieri in the wild growth. But then, like, somewhere in the mid game, who looked like he maybe ran out of cards, like, Cairn is maybe a little bit too weak of a card. Might be a bad card in the deck, or bad against me. I got a little lucky with getting the one preparation off the top. But at the same time, though, I didn't, I couldn't draw my uh, conceal. I think if I had a conceal for the auction, I would have a pretty easy game. God damn it. I mean, dude, we got so lucky, too. We talked to the inner bait. I think I played a fine. I don't know. I don't know if I could have done anything better. Maybe dropping the Karen on curve was correct. Probably wasn't like he had to have the one sap in his deck. He got lucky, dude. He got lucky. We're down to one. It is what it is, dude. It is what it is. It looked very close in the end. No conceal for the auction. You can sometimes make it a little trickier. It, it's not as like clean. Oh my goodness. Okay, Fire War Axe is insane. Best card in the deck. I could probably keep a shield slam too, because they don't do too much damage early on. So Norris is often back in the day, it was used for draw. Dear God, it's already over, dude. It's over. Okay, we threw back that card and we got a back pog. Oh my goodness. Okay. Well, good luck, Rara. Good luck. This is a wow with warrior as well. I'm gonna armor here because uh there's no reason to fire your axe. Oh my god. He kept two cards in his hand. This is a terrifying draw, my friend. Oh, we're so done. Oh, it's already over. Oof. It's good to get shield slam though. It's okay, we have more follow-ups. Yeah, Norris against the against the warrior, if I remember right. Like these days in constructed standard, you you see uh, Norris used for mana quite often, but uh, times used to be a little different, I think. And he always used the slam for something else though. So they're pretty. I don't know if that was necessarily like a really great play from them. Oh, maybe I'm overthinking this. Do I want to quirk on this or do I want to go for this? I, I don't really want to take damage unless I absolutely need to, right? but we can always use the quirk on for something else. Maybe I'm overthinking it. All right, a little bit awkward, if I'm being honest. Okay, I'm actually like scared. No, I did need these cards. I definitely needed these cards. Okay. Ooh. Oh yeah, it's two mana from this. So these used to be like not that easy to clear. There was no rank or anything, right? Might even have to like brawl this already. Yeah, I needed one more damage. It was insane. I wonder if it just get in again anyways. Like I take four here, but at least I have the seven five that they kind of need to deal with. If I issue is like, if I go into brawl right now and this lives, I'm in a worse position than if I just get in. What is that? <laughs> oh my god. So my first instinct was to swipe. Swipe this, swipe face. And he probably thinks I don't have brawl. Swipe is fine. Okay, I'll take a swipe. Oh my god. Getting closer to that 14 health mark. I don't think I used the weapon here. I could brawl. If I brawl, it seems kind of bad. I definitely need to kill this, right? So, like, this happens no matter what. I think I'm just doing this. Your minions off the board. Slight misplay, to be honest with you. Ha! Huh, misplay! So you have first attack and then armor. Oh, he didn't attack at all. All right, how much do we have here? Sometimes in these situations, it's also like good to ship it, even if it's not lethal. We have 17. Oh, I'm gonna hold it. Oh, the game. Ooh, not necessarily. I don't really have like the follow-up, the kind of follow-up that I would like to have if I went for it there to like just get the damage in. Much better like this. The same would be insane. Just not the one one. Dude, so lucky. So lucky, this Radran guy. So lucky. Rom. I'm still, I'm still doing pretty well. Still got a pretty good position here. I could go for rag, but rag doesn't seem that great. I take five. Okay, 
So if I take five here, the thing is I can kill this, right? So it just seems correct. Ooh. Oh my God. I don't know. I don't know if I'm ever playing this correctly, to be honest. But again, like I just have to not die. It's not lethal. Yeah, it's a little too big. I'm not comfortable leaving trap. Although I probably would have been fine going phase two. Out your boss. If they have the second one, they have the second one. Yeah, better like this. He could have traded down. No, no, you never have it. No. God damn it, dude. Combo number two. Oh, the BM. Oh, oh it's so sad. <laughs> Oh, God, he had to have both. Yeah, to be fair, I don't think there was a whole lot he could have done there. That's very favorable for Druid as far as I can remember, and my hand was also quite good. Dude, I don't know. Maybe if I was just a better player. Damn it, man. It's so brutal. GG's. I owe him 10 subs. Really good games. If you enjoyed this video, make sure you subscribe. Go check out Savit as well. And if you like this content, check out the Raynad money match. It was great.